Welcome to a brand new episode of the Doe and Deuce podcast, episode 27. I'm Doe. I'm Deuce. And, you know, this is a new episode. Right. All right, before, before we start, I'm just going to let everybody know most of the time we keep things nice and clean here on the podcast. Right, right. It might get a little dirty today. Get dirty. Like, it might get a little you dirty. Get dirty. I, I might drop some F-bombs yeah, out here, yeah, some yeah. stuff. I'm going to tell you now, you know, we try to keep it clean for y'all, right. but, you know, it, you know, it's 21 and over. Right. right. <laughs> so make sure you like, share, and subscribe. All right. All right. So NBA draft happening this week, you know what I'm saying? Busy week in the NBA. Very busy week. Busy you know? week, week. So, yeah, so we had... Uh, First one was the Jimmy Butler trade. Oh yeah, Jimmy let's, Butler. Let's start off. Jimmy Butler. I want, I want to know your opinion. First of all, get the trade out. The trade was basically Jimmy Butler and the 16 pick. Right. Goes to Minnesota. And Chicago gets Zach Levine, Chris Dunn, and the seventh pick, which is Laurie Marketing. Right. All right. 16 pick was uh, uh Justin Patton out of Creighton. So that's that was basically what the deal right. was. Your I like it. Like it. I like. I think. For you know, who? Huh? For who? For Minnesota. Minnesota. I like Minnesota because. They get big. They getting. They getting. They got that Minnesota got that young team, and they getting a good veteran to come in and mm-hmm. help out. You know, what I'm saying another good deep defender to go right. with Wiggins mm-hmm. and Towns. So I, I think, like real talk, like they could be in the in the pitch for the playoffs. Oh yeah, because they they shouldn't be in the pitch this year. But I really think they got a chance got to get the, like an eight. They might get the AC. I'm gonna say like this. Clippers, they got some work to do this this, this, oh, yeah. this year. Right. Utah, you don't know if they lose a Gordon Hayward and it's like oh, that. Right. True, true. I think I think Minnesota might be a six seed because right, right. OKC, you never know. Yeah, like, can can Russ yeah, repeat what he did this last season? Portland, uh, you ain't really. They still bring it on yeah. to the end of the season. Man, watch out, Minnesota. But I just want to know one thing about Minnesota. How the how did they get that motherfucking sixteen pick? How did they get the sixteen pick, Kenneth? Right. How did they get the sixteen pick? They should have got, got that. They should have got that. Right. I would have been like, no, you're not getting. You get Jimmy Butler. You get Jimmy Butler. He an all star. How did Chicago? Did they say, you know, some? We don't need sixteen pick. No, you keep everything. Right. Why? Cause assets. Right. Assets. What's the one big thing about the NBA? Right. You need, you need assets. assets. Chicago point guard situation right now. Right. Chris Dunn, Jeremy Grant. Um, what's my other? Rondo and uh, the man they got from OKC, the dancing dude. Would you oh, do? Cameron Payne. Cameron Payne. That's you're not gonna keep all of them. And and, and no, Carter Woods ain't on there, is he? Still, yeah, they and, like, and, yeah. And, and Carter Woods. <laughs> the Bulls got like nine point guards. <laughs> right. Assets. You're gonna buy Rondo out most likely. Right. You know what I'm saying? And you could trade one of these young young guys. And you keep your 16 pick. Right. And you draft. You keep that. Right. You do that. You think Minnesota really is gonna say no? You know, so <laughs> we don't. No, no deal. No deal. <laughs> no, they probably said, "Yo, this is actually stupid." You know, yeah, they they give it to us. Yeah, 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 no, 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 they was hang up. They call us back. You know, like what? You get that? I don't get how they pull that sixteen pick off. Right, right. They right. pull, they put a rabbit out of the right. on that one. Give it, Jimmy Butler's an all all NBA caliber oh, player. You're getting an all NBA player. Boy, a guy who tore his ACL, another guy who could beat Ricky Rubio for his position. Right, right. Really, <laughs> really? Come on, now, what did you? Uh, what did you really like? I would have like, yo, I would have shipped out another contract. I thought, yeah, I got to take one of these contracts with you. Right. Something. I'm not giving you 16. No, I'm taking that. I want that pick. Right. I want that pick to go with right. my other pick. Right. Sorry. Man, Chicago, wow. I, man, I'm not saying I could be an NBA GM, but I'm saying I could be an NBA GM. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not falling for that one. Right, right. Right. But as a, I think Minnesota, it's a great deal for them. Right. You know what I'm saying? I think Jalen Rose is going crazy. Like, you almost nutted himself. <laughs> you know, he was going crazy that, that night. <laughs> oh, my God. Jimmy Butler. That's that bad thing. All right, Jalen, calm down. Right, right. right. But they all get all the NBA player. A great guy who already played with Tibbs. I, right. Honestly, do you really think Jimmy Butler would want to go play with Tibbs again? I don't know. Because they say he ain't he, he, he he really that hype about it. Yeah, he wasn't really happy about it. Because, you know. <laughs> Tibbs runs you in the ground. Right, right. You know, right. Tibbs run you in the ground. If anybody don't know, I was right. D Rose and Joe Kim Noah. I know because we're looking at Joe Kim Noah is like a 2013 car right. with 100,000 miles on it already. Like, he, he burns you down. So I don't know, Jim Butler. I think he's like, all right, I get two years of me. Right, right. And I'm out of here. All right. So, you know, the deal was a great deal for them. Chicago, like I said, I don't understand why they gave away the 16th pick. They should have kept their pick. Um, the guy they drafted, God bless his soul. I heard this guy's a seven foot. Right, seven foot. Nothing about him. he's a uh, he can shoot, but they say he don't get no rebounds. He's a seven foot guy, he just shoot, seven foot shooter. They basically he rebounds like a point guard. They said so. 
Nigga, he went to Arizona. He averaged like one, two point two rebounds a game. That's crazy. Yeah, it's the, yeah, no, no lie. He's just a three point shooter. Yeah, I just saw the best, They say the best shooter of the draft. I want to say he averaged like two two rebounds a game. Mm-hmm. So that's what they got. They got a, they they they're trying to get a Porzingis, but they forget Porzingis rebounds and block shots. So he's not Porzingis. All right. So I laugh when that. He had um D'Angelo Russell one. Yeah, to Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Right. That, that, Brooklyn. Brooklyn. I think that was, that was another one good for the Lakers. That's good. They got rid of that Mazdo contract. <laughs> right. But it's like, NBA always have to help the Lakers and the Celtics. This is, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Like, when these guys on the phone making these trades, like, you really saying, I'm going to take the 10 of Well, Brooklyn, well, Brooklyn did this last year. You're not you're not getting your, that high pick, so why are you not trying to win? Like, right. why are you not trying to get Jalen Russell or uh, somebody last year? Right. You know, so they get uh, they get rid of Brooklyn Lopez. All right, they got Mazdo. And you know they they like hey we, they don't even have their pick next year so <laughs> they don't care so right. but they got a young asset Russell right. they got some good jump draft picks you know here and there but my thing is the Lakers they got what they needed you know say right. out of the deal got what they they, they, they <laughs> Mitch Cup check I don't know what they were thinking right. the Mazdog and dang the dang money I was like really right 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 the dang I remember when they signed Mazdog everybody like what yeah. they, they, they the, got first signed the first day. day first first one Freddie was going crazy in the internet then the, 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 dang got the extra year the fun thing the, the Wizards wanted dang. Right. But the Lakers guaranteed that fourth year. The Wizards like, we'll give you three years, and they're like, no. The Lakers say, no. We we want dang so bad for what? For four years? Huh? Mm-hmm. I'm not as a Wizard fan. I know you, but I don't know because then the Wizards didn't get him, and then they tried for Al Horford, didn't get Al Horford, then they signed your boy out of Indiana, uh, the big man. Yeah, seventeen million dollars. Yeah. <laughs> Mop tail. Uh, the one thing I can say about all these trades and everything you're, 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 we're learning about, a the salary cap went back. Right. So the salary cap is down two million dollars. So everybody thought the Saturday was going to be 100. All these guys spent last year, and they're like, oh, that Miles Golf deal's going to look good when they right, got right, right. 90 deals are bad, like a bad. It's like trick. They, they got trick bag. Right. Like, how do you, that, no, nobody see this coming. But they said it's because no playoff games. Right. All right, the, the less playoff games, <laughs> the less the clap is. So, you know, Boston, all of them got screwed. Everybody, right. by Cleveland and the Golden State, so win all, all the games. It, 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 the salary cap is $2 million less than everybody thought it was. So, now you stuck with basically the people on your team, right? right? right. So um, Paul George, Davis floated out there. Paul George, you know, they were talking about maybe going to Cleveland, yeah. LA. Even some of my boys Washington and that. Mm-hmm. I, yo, I, I, would, I would trade for him, yo. But if we could get Paul George, I don't, oh, no Porter, you know how I feel about him. Hey, well, you know, <laughs> I'll take, I would take that rental. What's the, what's the, what, I, I'm Indiana. Right. You, 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 you're the Wizards, right? Give me your best deal. I, 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 I got Paul. Oh, no Porter. And then, uh, that's it. That's what I'm getting. That's all you get. Paul George is walking next year. He's, uh, it is what it is. You take it or leave it. Take it or leave it. <laughs> I, I, I need some. What you gonna get? What, what you gonna get? Oh. Who else? Uh, well, I don't know. <laughs> what? I don't what are you gonna get for the league? He wanna go to LA. What are you gonna get for LA? I'm not paying out of points. He, he gonna get that money this year. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. I forgot what team I saw like giving that bread. Mm-hmm. But. Well, I'll be a, I, maybe I'll be a. Uh, I could be a dick and say, hey, look, I was, I was, I was signed out of points with twenty million. You know, restricted joint and burn you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So to do a quick sign of trade, I have to burn you like that. But my thing is, nah, I think as it's Indiana, I'm, I'm, nah, I'm like it's out of Porter. That's it. Uh, <laughs> so I gotta wait for another out of Porter to develop, and hopefully he'll be half of Paul George is. I don't think so. And I'm not out. And then by you just giving me out of Porter and you don't want him, that makes me feel kind of crazy. Because like, the longer they wait, the less they're gonna get. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> but I, honestly, and push gonna show no, they could do. I mean, it's going to be bad, but they can hope we make all NBA team and, and, yeah. and, and, and get that somebody, money. And I heard this through somebody else on the podcast. I don't know how I'll call Toronto and say, hey, give me DeMar DeRozan. <laughs> they ain't trading them. Huh? They ain't trading them. Bye. Maybe they won't. Because you're going to be like, all right, are they going to count Lowry $30 million? Like, is Toronto really going to count Lowry $30 million? Right. Right. Think about it. Right. You know, if he, if, if he count Lowry, I'm going to get $30, i will go somewhere else. Right? Right. right. So, Cal Lowry goes, you really going to build your team behind DeMar DeRozan and who? Get a get from under that money. Start from scratch. You know, jury, you know, the guy, <laughs> the, the GM there, he'd have to trade somebody. Right. I'll trade DeMar DeRozan to Indiana. He's, a, he's under, under contract for a while for Paul George. I know Paul George ain't staying. <laughs> I'll flip him to the Lakers for the, for the minimum. All right, give me a three if you can have him. You know what I'm saying? But I, that's how I'm thinking. Right. Look, right. Toronto's not beating Cleveland. They're not beating, like, this is the best they get. They're maxed out right now. Right. All right. right, right I'm right, sorry. Right. I can't do it. This is me. You know. So that's a couple moves I would do. Now, what do you think? Another thing um, about um, it was kind of funny with Cleveland. At first, um, Jimmy Butler, mm-hmm. he he was all for going to Cleveland. Yeah. Then a couple of days later, he changed his mind. You know why? The bad phone. Right. You know, they called LeBron. Probably this is what I think honestly happened. Mm-hmm. I think Bron probably called D Wade up. Mm-hmm. Was like, yo, 
Tell them, yo, tell them don't come in. Yeah, don't come in. Don't come in. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> don't come in because I'm out. I'm out. Dude. You come in Because how he's all for it, yeah. the next thing you know, two days later, he didn't want to go to work. Yeah, because yeah, LeBron told him. I'm not staying here. I'm out. Yeah, don't worry. What do you think, you think about that? You think Brown bouncing? Yeah, Brown's bouncing. He's bouncing, yo. The writing is on the wall, yo. Brown bouncing. He built it. To, Brown, the gym, built up the team. <laughs> Brown's got all these guys paid and said, oh no, what we have, we can't trade none of these guys? Alright, I'm gonna do my little, I'm gonna do my year tour right. or whatever. Because LeBron could always make it the max. He's right. not taking no pay cut to go nowhere. Right. So he can go to the Lakers or wherever you want to mm-hmm. go, or Clippers or anywhere you want to go, and he'll be out. He's going, he, LeBron's gonna put LeBron in the best situation. Right. Again, at the end of the day, LeBron's trying to get the six rings. He don't care how he gets it. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? LeBron, you know, he's just trying to do what he gotta do. He's gonna put himself in the best position that he right, wants right. to do. You know what I'm saying? So LeBron's looking at, he probably told whoever, the owner, look, man. You know what it is. My my team buying houses out in LA right now. Right. You know, he sold his house in Miami, he buy a house out in LA. Right. You know, so I he got hurt he he enrolled his kid in the school there. Yeah, right? he, he, his wife first thing, the main thing his wife wanna live there. Yeah. So the wife run the house. So yeah. at the end of the day the right the wall. And the funny thing is I didn't it, it wasn't out at first, but his family, mm-hmm. everybody else was against him going back to Cleveland. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how I felt the whole time mm-hmm. because of that letter. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He shouldn't have went back. Yeah. So in the background, his mom was all about, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't go back. Don't go back. Right. So, so he definitely yeah. out of there. But the Brown probably told him, I can't stay here. Chris Bosch going to get hurt. <laughs> right, right, right. He, he, <laughs> right. D-Wade's old. I'm not, I'm not playing right, right, right. with these guys again. So what about um, Dan Gilbert? Y'all didn't sign David Griffin. Yeah. It's crazy. Like this dude went to three finals. Mm-hmm. One one of them mm-hmm. brought in J.L. Smith mm-hmm. and um, Schumper. Stolen, stolen Knicks. <laughs> got Shannon Fry. Mm-hmm. You know that other good pickup. Yeah. Got Kyle Korver. Mm-hmm. Got Darren Williams. Mm-hmm. And you mean to tell me you don't get to do the extension? Um, I think <laughs> David Griffin probably said Phil Jackson's a guy in New York who's running his team in the ground, and he makes four million dollars. Mm-hmm. Um, I need at least nine. You know what I'm saying? I understand that. You know, you're not gonna pay like that dumb, but right. I'm gonna need at least nine. And that the damn girl was saying, no, I'm gonna give you five. I think he said, all right, I'm done. And I, um, I heard somewhere, um, first of all, Dan Gilbert never extended none of his GMs ever. His 12 years, he never extended none of them. And, he, and, I, and I heard on another podcast that the way he run the NBA team, that's how he do it. Um, business? Yeah. Like business. <laughs> and so he, he don't really respect upper management like that. It's funny because that's the opposite <laughs> of the New York Knicks. Everybody know what the New York Knicks got. The Knicks Knicks owner fires everybody, but won't fire Phil Jackson. It was just crazy. He right. fires his head of security, he fires everybody like, you do a bad job, he fires him quick. But Phil Jackson, um, nah, I'm just, yeah, whatever. Yeah, I, yeah, you doing a good job, whatever. Right, right, right. Yeah, right. So that's that's what that right. is. It's like, crazy. Like, you, like, what else can you do? You go three straight finals, many times you can't get this. And then he went, that hurt even dirty, that like, he wouldn't even let him go interview for them other jobs. Yeah, that's what that's how it is. He was a dirty dude. <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. You're like, yeah. Chauncey, don't go sign. Don't go Cha- go there, yo. They said Chauncey, you know, because, you know, he like living in Denver, and, you know, his daughter's a high school yeah. senior. Uh, senior. Right. And, you know, like I say, he's happy where he's at. He's right. a nice, easy ESPN job. Right. But they're saying that. He's really, you know, he, you know, the league. He's doing a lot of research. Like, you know, he about, wanted, he, wanted that, that I, I, yeah, I think he, I think he want to do that type of job because he want to be, you know, African American. Right, it, it, like, like when you, you know what I'm saying, you, like, you really, like, you can't really let them opportunities go by. No matter, no matter what, you know, what I'm saying, to get in the door, cause they might like, oh, he, 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 he might not never get an opportunity and, like that. And he, and he, like, put other people on that he know that right. is good. But, you right. know, what I'm saying, I, I think, I think Chauncey, it's, 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 it's something like, do I really? I don't need to, right. but. I'll do it. You open the door for yeah, other people, though. Door. Yeah, I open the door, and you know, you probably can say, I give me a five year deal. You know what I'm right. saying? I need that five years. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? So it's be a good thing. It, 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 All right, so we're going we to hit in the draft. So, yeah. more cut folks went number one and said, mm-hmm. Yeah, um, you know, that was, that was easy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? That was everybody's number one choice, right. really. We always said, we think, you know, I, 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 I changed my mind, they're not going to the playoffs, but they're going to do good. It depends how y'all do it. It depends how healthy they are, y'all. Look, Bulls, Jimmy Butler gone, so that's another. Yeah. Gonna fall off. I just, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not confident enough to. Oh, say we got, we got, we wait once. Um, yeah, yeah we'll see. Ben this. Simmons and them, see how they look. Yeah, free agency, let's see now. Right, right, right. Free agency. Yeah. Two, the ladies got the ball. ball. Yeah. You know. My favorite pick. <laughs> I'm, I'm team ball. I'm team. Right. I'm team Lonzo. I'm team LeVar. Right. You know anybody like I got to say, if you coach AAU basketball, you're around the AAU basketball, you do not see a lot of fathers out there. Right. You see a lot of mothers. 
I'm telling you, man. You see a guy who supports his kids like he do. Right. I got nothing but respect for him, man. That man, right. and, and he's smart. He got everybody looking at him right. while his son on that court ball. Right, right. You know what I'm saying. Right. I mean, be funny for saying, you know, tell him to something, duck on him so hard, make his daddy come out and get him. <laughs> right, right. But don't, don't worry, ball. I'm telling y'all, ball, we be it ball ain't gonna be legit. Put, Paul Wall's legit, man. I'm, I like it. All right. Um, third was uh, Tatum. Tatum. I'm not a big fan. I'm of not a fan of you. But you know, you know what's funny about that? Um, they wanted to work out Josh Jackson here, but yeah, hey, yeah, then they flew yeah. all the way to Sacramento. Yeah. He said he was working out. He would. Yeah, I don't blame him though. Like yo, all right, you um, you Josh Jackson. Mm -hmm. You go, you, you go to um, Boston, yeah. you already know your minutes is extra limited. Extra limited. Not even limited, extra limited. <laughs> and you're, you're the same player as the guys in front of you. Right. right? Every badly. Marvin Smart, <laughs> right. you know, Jay Crowder, those are those the guys in front of you. His agent probably was like, yo, don't work out for them. And you know what Isaiah Thomas, who's not going to make you a better player? Right. Come on now. No, I said, I don't want to go there. I'll go. Phoenix, y'all young, we young, let's run. We're we gonna run together, baby. You know, Brad Stevens, he's a nice coach and all that, but nah. He nah it's perfect, it ain't a fit. Nah, it's not a good fit. It's for him, it's not a good fit, so mm -hmm. he, he didn't probably want to play, play for with him. Right. Alright, so, you know, that was him. Uh, so Tatum get Tatum. They say Tatum like a Rudy Gay or something, but they're really way athletic. Way more athletic. Way more athletic. <laughs> you know, this guy's poor piss type, whatever. Then you got um, Darren Fox. Right. He went to Sac um, Sacramento. Sacramento right. just took the best point guard available. Right. Um, Jalen Rose had me laughing with his player comps. Wait, 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 Jerry Rubio, wasn't it? No, Alter Payton. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, really? Just because he got the same hands now? Right, right, You're right. tripping. Right, right. Yes, this guy's a left handed John Wall type. Right, right, you know, he's right, fast. Right, right. Um, then you got Jonathan Isaac going to Orlando. Right. You know, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like him. I like him. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know what I'm saying? Um, then the marketing um, draft pick. And then, <laughs> I'm sorry, people. The motherfucking Knicks. New York Knicks. What the fuck? I look. I don't know. This, this French guy might be the man. He might. He might turn out and be the man. Right. I won't know. Right. But I'm telling you now. I want it. You know who I want. Um, uh, oh, that's all I want. Well, I'm. I'm at. I'm not. See, Kevin Perry like I wanted to see him in New York. I want him in New York. <laughs> I want. I need a heat check guy. I need right. a guy who's gonna shoot. And I, I know Monk wanted to be there. Right. I know his table was bubbling. They was probably like, yeah, <laughs> we go to the garden. Yeah, we going to the garden. We did it. We, you know, a lot, on the real. Um, Say what you want to say about the Knicks. A lot of guys wanted to go to New York. <laughs> I just wanted to go to New York. Right. He's yeah. Like, he, 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 he bought it. Yeah. And he did it to like ten. Yeah. He's like, I, I didn't want to go to New York. <laughs> a lot. A lot of these guys wanted to go to New York. Right. Dude, dude's talking about um. Uh, Jimmy John Jackson. Right. He wanted to go to New York. <laughs> Dudes wanted to form a drive to go to New York. So y'all might try to diss my boys and right. say, you know, we sorry, we are sorry, but. It's nothing like playing in the garden, and he's nothing like playing in New York, right? right? So stop all that, like, you know, the Knicks ain't relevant and stuff like that. Right. You, know, you know, some of these podcasts, they be trying, trying to hoard the Knicks. Right. Like, yeah, I know we sorry because Phil Jackson, but don't act like playing in New York is nothing right, spe right, it's right, not right, special. Right. But back to my rant. Malik Monk, a guy who kills, kills in college. Right. Dominates it, big shots. Reminds me of a guy in Golden State that we want to pick away from getting. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> in college, who's hitting big shots. Right, right, right. right. Dominating. Right. We pick the guy. I've never seen play. Right. A pick up the game. Pick up. Pick up on anything. Now the guy, he did. He was leading his team to a championship game. He's 18 years old. Right. He's young. Right. He again. I preface it saying, if he's nice, I'm gonna be a big fan. Don't get Frank Nicotine, whatever his name is. <laughs> right. Nicotine. I, I don't know the man's name, but I'm might. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna jump on the bandwagon. Right. Don't. I'm not lying. But they talk about he. He gonna be all right. But he. He. Yeah. he but I want to leave Monk. All right. Malik so Monk. Phil Jackson. I, if Malik Monk turns it to be something, <laughs> oh man, oh man. So I, my, man, my man Colin, we text. I said, have the bail money ready. <laughs> we, have, we we going for him. All right, so after that, um, Dennis Smith Jr. Right, I like the him. Dennis Smith Jr. I would have took him. I would have took him. <laughs> okay. He's going to Dallas. If he becomes anything, I think he'll be legit. Yo, them highlights we get you. I think this, they, they say like he take games off, but that's, that's you know what I'm saying? Whatever. Make it the league into the ACL. He know he know the chill. Right. Yeah, right, anybody, right. Anybody who tore the ACL, he like, they even doing. They even doing work in the ACC. It would work. You see the highlights. Man. <laughs> man, come on now. Then you got Zach Collins. He yeah. went number ten to uh, the dumb, another dumb trade. <laughs> Sacramento, what are you doing trading your ten pick for a fifteen and uh, what was it the uh, seventeen pick or something like that? Right. Like really? No, the twenty pick it was like the fifteen pick and the twenty pick. No, no, was the fifteen. It was the uh, yeah, it was fifteen pick and twenty pick. Really? Really? <laughs> so I'm gonna trade this, this draft got 10 to 11 good players. I'm gonna 
I have two. I get two of the top ten players. I'm gonna trade one to get. There's a reason why they give you those two picks. Right. Portland's giving you those two picks for that one pick. They know this is trash. Right. Right. All right. right. They like uh, you can have these, these trash picks. And, and but you pick. With your picks, Sacramento, you picked Justin Jackson out of North Carolina, which, okay. Right. And Harry Giles, who right. tore his ACL twice. Right. right, he might not even play for real. Vlade Divac, again. <laughs> I'm not saying I could be an NBA GM, but I could be an NBA GM. If that's what they do. Right. Uh, Zach Collins, uh, played for Gonzaga, he fouled out a lot, right. always got in foul trouble. <laughs> the general come build, uh, build that beard. <laughs> Whatever. But then Charlotte takes Malik Monk. Um, that's, that's a good fit for them. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be, I'm tired. Charlotte might be hard because they got Dwight Howard. Yeah. They got Nicholas Bettine, they right. got um, my man uh, Kimber Walker. Kimber Walker, they got a good spot. They got, they got, they got then uh, they end up, they got, um, they got Luke Kennard. Right. You know what I'm saying? He went to Detroit. I like Luke Kennard. That's crazy, bro. I like his game. I like it, you know. He, he said he's going to win number 23. You know, I don't, I don't know Michael Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> That's guy's the best. Uh, that, uh, it, was, it was like, and then after that, was, um, my boy from Syracuse got drafted. I was happy. Mm -hmm. Tyler, Lydon, whatever. Uh, yeah. Uh, no, I don't know if you watched it. Uh, Tom Crane, uh, he was on. Uh, he was on with uh, what's the man? Yo, uh, Wojo, Wojo Housky. Yeah. They, they, they had the jack coverage. Oh yeah. Uh, Tom Crane was killing. Him. Was a couple of people. He, he was pregnant. He's, he, he's, I'm, I'm praising his boy Edge Bio. Yeah. But then he started. He was killing my man Ty Lyra and say, I don't see how some of these guys are getting drafted. I'm like Tom Crane, really? The dude from Indiana. I didn't yeah. really like him. I, I, yeah. I didn't mind Indiana, yeah. though. Yeah. Like no. Yeah, uh, Tom. And when I, I saw his name in the, the, the one of the top draft, like for real. Tom, Tom Crean is the reason why you're doing analyst work now. So we had some um, other like seniors who got drafted, stuff like that. Like you got the um, Josh, Josh Hart, I blew over, right. and then Frank Mason. He got drafted in the second round. That was crazy. I didn't know yo, um, yo was committed to go to Towson. Yeah, that's crazy. I didn't know that either. And then when he he fell some tests and stuff, he went back to school, and the guy got yeah, crazy. In Kansas. Tom, Tom's like, we could have had him. Right, right, right. 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 Again, if you go to Towson, he, he's not gonna be Frank Mason. He he gonna be Frank Mason. He might have been NBA Frank Mason, but he's going. If you nice, you nice. But in Kansas, you know, you know, playing with them nice guys, playing with, with Wiggins and all them guys. He played with a lot of guys who came through Kansas. Yeah, well, not one year. When he got nice and nice. Nice and nice. He might. They, they still probably been nice though. Was, I ain't gonna say it wouldn't be nice, but it's better to go to Kansas Towson. No doubt. Yeah, right? <laughs> ain't playing. All right. So he he's a, he was the second round pick. Um, my recap of the draft is this. Uh, well, more mellow than get drafted. <laughs> oh, but you, you know he signed with, right? Philly. Yeah, Philly. He probably make the team too. Yeah, uh, Sometimes it's better not to get drafted, yeah, yo. Go, 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 you, you go, go with your thing. You and your agent talk and like, yo, you got a good opportunity to make the team. team. Like TJ, you, like, what, TJ McConnell, yeah. point guard. Oh, you think you can't take his spot? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We'll see you on the summer league. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then um, my man, um, the dude who hit the game winner for Villanova, he played East Town with the Wizards. Right, you know right. what I'm saying? So, you know, that's the, 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 the draft. I always talk about the drafters. We'll see him when they start playing. Right. Like, we saw Buddy Hill at Summer League. Right. We were not impressed with Buddy Hill at Summer League. Right. Right. So when they told me you were struggling in, in, in New Orleans, right. I'm not surprised. But sometimes it's a system. And then, yeah, so system now it's Sacramento. Take time. And it's confidence. And, and he started playing better when he got a second medal. Yeah, right, because right, it's confidence. Now he got, you know, the last squad. And I, yeah, he's playing Summer League. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's play So, you know, that's going to be a squad I want to see. All right, so it's like, it's like the recap of the draft is, hey, the Knicks effed it up again, like they always do. Um, <laughs> Phil Jackson, you better not trade Porzingis. Or <laughs> stuff. You don't just bring that Porzingis name out your mouth. Just get your little $12 million a share and go away. Right, All right, right, right. Whatever with the draft, whatever with, it, with everything. I'm pissed off about everything about because I want to be Malik Monk. I want to do the Smith Jr. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it, is Smith, it is the Smith Jr. Yeah. But I, I wanted him. But right. that's beside the point. But thanks for watching the podcast. Like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff we do. Uh, you know, just make sure you check us out. All right. Yeah.